What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to another casual conquest. We're playing Robin Jungle with a Chunga solo, a Yorm Scuddy dual lane, a Scylla mid. We're gonna be fighting, let's see, a probably Ardeo Artemis dual lane, a Set Jungle, a Cyrus solo, and an Aphrodite mid. So let's start off with just set and plus and these outings. Some pots and blink, because blink on Robin is really good. Let's see if. Some pretty decent burst damage. We gotta be close. The blink's nice Great too. To Your next people. Hunt. Also, it works well with your immunity because you immune something. You're closer to blink's two-second cooldown timer, where you can blink away from stuff. So that's pretty good on Robin. Beads will, would also be viable here versus Artemis, Osiris, and Nardio, as well as Aegis. We'll go blink. Blink's more fun too. And we'll start. Blue or blue. Do mid harp or back harpies, and then go do Chunga's blue buff. I know a lot of people like to go speed blue back harpies now. I don't know if that's faster. Or maybe it's actually better to go a little bit slower, so you get to mid camp second, so you can contest them easier. I have no idea. I don't know how that works out. Take this jungle buff. Okay, thanks. Let's see, versus a set. I'm actually gonna get my heal here. Problem is, he can run over and just immediately steal this. I mean, I guess we can try and kill him. Oof. We have blinks, we should be able to kill him. No, he blinked! That's why he's the cast. Fare thee well. <laughs> Finally getting used to it, and we were able to blink. Most nice we got Afro Aegis, that's pretty good. I'm able to get three off a of heal. Steal a red. She does not have enough health to contest this. So we should hit level three off this. I just want to hit that one to make sure we get level 3. No problem. We're gonna go gank left because this is totally a free kill. On both of them. Should be able to kill Artemis, I think. Yeah. Alright, so we got 2. So, so far, pretty good. We have 3 kills. In two and a half minutes. Things could be worse. We'll just steal the melee minions here. Or some of them. And actually we'll back and we'll get speed. Oh, this is gonna be super okay, it's gonna be super wasteful. But we'll wait a couple seconds, get Plaria, so we move faster. Run back into the base and hopefully set has not slowed our speed buff by now, which I don't believe he has. Be careful middle. Hopefully Scylla is able to live. Hopefully she is. I'm just gonna keep farming. I don't know if they stole red or not. Not quite have my ult yet. I'll blink back. Oh man, I missed my two there. Oh, we'll pick up the kill. Thanks. Alright, let's 
go. Go gang left, because they're level 3 and I'm level 5. So that should be a pretty fair fight. This is why I like farming for a little bit and then fighting. Attack. Just you and me. Let's see if we can't blink on Artemis here. He's, I don't know where she went. Ooh. Oh no. So I missed my one. <laughs> yeah, she was right to left there because that was a fail on my part. But if I had landed my one, she would have instantly died. Problems I missed. Um, and then my three, I thought maybe I could three auto. But even if I landed by three, I was probably still f too far away to auto her before I died. But it was worth a shot. I mean, you gotta go for it, right? Retreat. I can't be in that situation and have Blink up and not try and kill her. An enemy has been slain. Most impressive. So let's go for her speed. Let's check, see. So Scotty's top damage, Shanga's top mitigated. Should probably kick right lane at this point. Well, Artemis is top of everything now on their team. So we probably definitely. Probably definitely. I definitely want to go gank Artemis again and actually kill her. Put my ults back up. We'll have to head over there and kill her. Make up for last time. Uh. Still got him. Thanks. Look at that. Be careful, middle. I have an ult, so I'm not gonna try and fight her for right now. I'm just farm for more. More of a lead. The model cancels in, so I autoed. Couple times, three autoed, one. One to slow the melee minions, keep them in range of Silas too. No problem on my way. Blink over here to try and help Trunga. Osiris is lagging out of lagging his brains out, but We'll use the model cancels again to kill Osiris. That was good old boy Tranga. We'll steal his blue buff. As, as a whole winner, getting your blue buff stolen is very annoying. So, no problem. We will, you know, be sure to do that. Let's steal his normal buff. I'll come back here, I mainly do speed, so you know, if set doesn't steal mine. Um, I'm actually level my one over my ult here, even though leveling Robin ult is very good. There's a lot of good stuff, I think, like damage, cooldown, and you get more mitigation. Yep, pretty good. But the one is also really good, so... This life decisions, man, I don't know. The deep thoughts that I have. Thanks. <laughs> Not really. Let's just continue farming. Get the gold, dark gold things, whatever those things are called, gold harpies. They're already a little sick for all of mine. Probably not worth it to stand here and fight these port. Oops, old Artemis here. I got him back immediately because someone's gonna come over and murder me. <laughs> so far we're doing alright. Um, since we are super far ahead, I'm actually gonna get Transcendence. In all caps, because I'm very angry. And we'll get some potions and some wards. So now I'll level the ult. 
You won't get the cane. Oh, he's doing well on their team. Part of us still. Is that gonna kill? Where my money at? Okay. This guy he killed that. It's pretty good. Take this jungle buff. I'll gank. Actually, I'm going to try and get Transcendence here to kind of extend my lead a little bit. Or, like, keep it going, I guess. Let's so we'll leech off mid here. Yeah, those people. Be careful. But now we'll also help her, because... Oh, plus he's my friend. <laughs> and my clan. Okay. We'll ward down. My blue, man. All right, let's go mid. You know, Should probably going after that. I don't know why I keep going on. Oh my! This is never land a three. Never quite land a three. Right. So I struggle. I like to try and keep an eye on the map all the time. And again, I'm no. Grand Master Juggler, by any means. I just play casual a lot. <laughs> or at least I used to. I don't know, recently not quite as much. But, anyway. So I just jungle. Keep an eye on the map a lot. Um, just see, like, what's up. What you could farm. And also, I like to kind of draw a line in my head. If I'm actually paying attention, which this game I am not, because I'm talking. I can't talk and actually play well. It's just, I'm not. My brain doesn't work like that. Anyway. Um, so draw a line in my head, like halfway along the map, and if they push over that line, you go gank them. It's a lot easier if they're near your tower line. Because they have to run a lot further. And you're jungler, so you should have speed buff and movement abilities to be faster than them. That's pretty good. Let's try to be like, kind of efficient with your time, I guess. We'll get transcendence. The best Century ward. We we'll get uh, probably get beads here. Your team has destroyed a left enemy Actually, since we're going such an offensive item, we'll get magized next. So we'll just kind of keep that in mind and move out. We should drop a Century on fire. That's still pretty early. Defend the Gold Fury. I thought I did do the oracles so we can see them there. That's pretty helpful. I gotta stack this transcendence, but it will give me a lot of damage. So that's nice. Gank. And that's why I went transcendence to ones, because I can do stuff like that. <laughs> Thanks. So a good old with my buddy there. Prove me right you back. You finish off uh their Afro. Supposed to sell it all, so if anybody else had turned up you would have been able to you get the reset, so you would have been able to uh kill someone else. That was good. And plus I don't really mind like what are those called? Kill stealing in this game? Because I'd rather have us get the kill, like someone get it, than them not, like than them get away. The only problem with that is when uh. The only problem with that. Oh, the only time I don't kind of follow that logic is when somebody kind of pissed me off, and then I'd prefer to steal kills from them and whatnot. <laughs> I'm gonna blink. Oh shit! Well, 
I just beads by I was trying to blink, but I don't have my three I would chase. Oh, I will chase now because it's a little end it. Oh, I'm dead. Oh well. Worse. <laughs> um, you know what? I could get Magi's or I could get Hide of the Urchin. And just be super tanky. Instead of having a CC shield. Because the shield would be nice versus. Really, I don't think Scent can destroy or can pop Magi's. I know, obviously, Artis Artemis can, Osiris can with his three, and his ult, I think. Afro can with her two and her one, and of course, Ardeo can. In like six different ways. But. So, yeah, we well, should just go Urchin here to try and continue to get kills and assists, and then just be super tanky. And it gives you health and mana. The mana will be nice. With uh, Transcendence, because Transcendence converts your max mana, well, 3% of your max mana to physical power. So, more damage. Oh, building defense. Who doesn't love that? So, now we just gotta stack it. Stop buying. Gold. Help defend gold. Yes! Who called that? Fella. Retreat middle lane! I'm gonna get all these red buffs, that's pretty helpful. Cool. I don't know what I missed. I really need beat stick as well, like really, really badly. I'm pretty low here. I don't really have healing, I just kinda have damage. And avoid damage, so. <laughs> Walked over and stole a kill. Uh, oh, if only I had Urchin. And yeah, they got that, but at least we get the timer now. But four of them are dead, we can definitely get this. Alright, never mind. Because if they came over, we definitely could have gotten Gold Fury. But for some reason, they're standing for a tier 2. They might die? I don't know. But hey, I don't think this is the highest, the, uh, highest ELO match I've ever played. So. We'll get in there and transcend its stacks. One day. Pretty set, man. <laughs> and he just blinked away like half a mile. <laughs> Whoops. Well, I just wasted my blink. Trying to kill the one on one health set. Who had his blink up and then just blinked. Funny thing is, he didn't even do it because I blinked towards him. He was already like doing it yet. So, rip me. Oh, what do we want next? Artemis is definitely. But I do want more damage, so let's get beat thick, because they have a lot of healing between all of them. But mostly Aphrodite, Ardeo, and Artemis, most likely. Let's see. Yep. 
Oh, even on Cyrus with Blood Shield. So, Weed Stick's gonna be helpful against everybody. Maybe not set, but everybody else. Yeah, my speed buff. Be careful. Hopefully Aaron doesn't okay. steal it. <laughs> Hopefully he does not. He's a good teammate. So they've played a bunch of people in casual games who just are more than happy to steal buffs. And normally I don't mind as much, but it's just a jungle. It's kind of annoying. It's kind of hard to farm stuff nearly as efficiently without running around really fast. See, if I had beat the cure, she would be dead by now. She would be dead already. Oh, but she still died, so it worked out. <laughs> nice little ult. Yeah, I'm yeah, yeah. right. gonna stand really far away so that I can pull fence. Hopefully, over here. I'm gonna kill already over here. Oh my god. Oh, we're so dead. We're so dead. I just ran, I shouldn't have stayed. So now all I have to do is say is live. Okay, good. See, that's why Robin with Blink is so good, because you just two. And Blink, especially since the video's instant cast, it's kind of guaranteed. So you just two and then Blink to live. Uh, and we get fire. And Divertrin. So this is actually looking pretty good now. So I just gotta not die. Group up. We got speed buff for 20 seconds. Level 15, dude. What are you doing? Yeah, you better run. <laughs> now I just run away. I love Bo Robin, dude. Just go in, use a bunch of stuff, and then immune your way out. Alright. Top damage, top kills, top kills. I mean, he does kind of fall off, that's what I think. Like, you have to have a good early game if you want to have any impact at all. If you have a bad early game, you're gonna have a rough time as Robin. At least in jungle. I never play him solo anymore. I haven't done that in, like, years. It's like... Oh, I think... Since he was this way, but still, it's been quite a while. Him being an assassin now and all. I don't know, I think he's more fun as an assassin, for sure. I get a lot more kills with him now than I ever did before. I actually just kind of remember dying a fair amount as him when I played him solo. That was maybe personal experience, but. You never know. Maybe if my team actually goes and okay. attacks. Help. You gotta be so good at Stars to the range. Oh, if I was that, I was dead. But we still kill them. It works. Or our team, rather. I think we. Got that. We still have Fire Giant. This is looking pretty good. Oh. I should not. Ooh! 9 health. Nice. 
I was say, I should not have walked into the tower there. Thankfully, it is actually just them too, so I'm totally fine. I couldn't back earlier, but I wasn't like paying attention. Okay. Uh, let's get. Artemis. Hmm. What is all versus Artemis? Uh, I can well not that great. Christians are more mostly ability based. Um, I guess Titan's made isn't terrible. It's not versus Artemis necessarily, but versus more Cyrus and Ardeo, because Ardeo don't really do any damage to you. Now I should do quite a bit of damage to her. So. Or rather, when I finish Titan's Bane, I'll do quite a bit more damage to their tanks, which would be nice. So that's why I got higher the Urchin when I did, because it's fully stacked now. That's basically going to be my only defense item. We have over 100 physical defense and about 100 magical. Well, it's over 2k health and a little shield. Uh, just for one item. That's pretty good. And some mana. Which translates to a little bit more power, too. <laughs> the game where people just run away. And our shield is so huge, by the way, because we have part Heart of the Urchin, part uh, part passive. Sorry, I had to stop talking. Focus there for a moment to murder Aphrodite. This set, on the other hand, it's funny because apparently, I don't know, apparently I don't have to focus. <laughs> Alright. Artemis, we gotta be a little bit careful when we fight, but everybody else we can basically just murder. Alright, we gotta run around and go do a bunch of jungle camps. Or apparently not up. I guess I didn't see that. Or maybe it wasn't on the map, I don't know. Not too much stuff is up, so I'm just back. I probably should have stayed to help out with stuff, but I figured we are kind of low. I don't want to die. I know I should just gonna run around and do more camps, but... Nothing was up yet, so... Oh, it's all coming up. Let's speed up first, just to run around faster. Go do mid camps, and then go see what we can do on the left side. They do harpies first just because they're neutral. Meaning it's easier to secure our buffs than it is neutral stuff for theirs. I just did this purple one. Well, I'm here. That's good because now we got Vision of the Gold Fury when it's up. No problem. Ultimate is ready. The only problem is Robin is early game and Artemis is late game. And we're definitely getting to late game. We're gonna play pretty smart here if we wanna have any hope. So that RDO had a good play there showing up kinda of behind us. Trunger got a kill here on set, so it's pretty good. We'll use immunity. Dive in here, get a kill on Ardeo. Kill the Artemis. And this probably is game. And we got a triple kill out of it. Cool. <laughs> and we'll just go. Kill the Titan here. So yeah, we just killed one Phoenix. They still have a tower up. It's gonna take a little bit, but they're all dead for long enough that... That was a good game. <laughs> we had damage, kills, and gold.
I mean, the Artemis stuff have played very well, but so did a bunch of people on our team. So that helped out. Like, I have plenty of casual games where people steal my buffs all the time or do side camps or whatever constantly, and they get cut up behind, which I hate to be as a juggler. So I'll give everybody commendations. GG will play, and let's go check the scoreboard. After pop ups, of course. Well, there, Chang'e did very well. They were on going 7, 1, and 11. Solo with the 5, 2, and 15 in mid lane. Which versus set uh, Afro is not the easiest. Arm um, having an excellent support score of 2, 2, and 21. Another team I still think played it pretty well, despite the fact that I just went on a massive killing spree. <laughs> because, um, like, they played well despite that. Like, I don't know, I just went around killing everyone. But I guess this is what Robin does if he gets fed early game. Is to just have transcend. Well, that's also why I got transcend when I did. Is to kind of ramp up, like, continue my lead. Like I said, I believe I said at the time, I uh, was to keep my lead going, basically, and have enough damage to do to a lot of light damage like through late game. And then we got High the Urchin to get just be tanky enough to survive, basically. Because yeah we have immunity, but they still do a lot of damage. So Magi is good, but it only keeps you alive through one hard card control effect. Where Urchin just kind of is solid for keeping you alive all the time. So that's nice. And then beat stick because they had a lot of healing in the form of Ardeo, Aphrodite Artemis Devourer Gauntlet, uh, and Osiris Glad Shield. As well as Ardeo Build Meditation, so that's good versus all that. Titan's Bane, because two of them, let's see, Ardeo had 184 physical defense, and Osiris had 153, so against both of them, Titan's Bane's quite good. Versus the others, not so much, but then we had Beat Second. Yo, Enzyme, much power. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.